As it's a train story, I'm quite understandably wearing a bright red anorak because this is a story of two railway stations and the disconnection between them and what could be achieved if they're reconnected. It's about the Bursco Curves project, which many people have heard about, but very few genuinely understand. Bursco isn't really a huge place, but it has a history. And it's busy these days. Very. But why two stations? On lines that cross, but never meet. They were joined once. The railways, for many years now, have been losing traffic to uh, road vehicles, to the private car, to the bus, and to the lorry. And this closure of uh, services is a necessary part, or at least a necessary accompaniment, of the other process of building up the good parts of the railway. The links, the curves, were a beaching cut. But 60 years later, despite Dr. Beeching, they're still here. The bottom of this ordinary road is the start of the southern curve. With bridges still in good nick, I used to live here in the 70s. And I never knew. They're not always easy to find, though. But here they are. There's a very good case for restoring the curves, as I hope to explain in the next video.